Good morning and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this morning with Barry and Buddy and what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Buddy's ability to understand and respond to his obedience commands, the correction and the motivation that we give the puppies when we're working with them, and the training equipment that we're using. Barry's using a regular six-foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of the leash folded neatly in his right hand. That leaves the left hand free to give the correction and the correction that we give is a little tug and let go on the training collar and that is the second piece of equipment that we're using and Barry will be demonstrating for you how to use that properly during your lesson. Now Buddy is sitting very nicely at Barry's left which is where all of our obedience training is done and the first exercise that they're going to demonstrate for us is healing. Healing is proper walking on a leash. The command is Buddy heal and his job at this point is to walk along next to Barry without forging ahead or lagging behind and each time that Barry stops his feet Buddy's been taught to sit automatically to wait for his next command and that's without being told. So when you're walking down the street you have a dog that's well controlled, that's paying attention to you and each time that you stop, whether it's to cross traffic or talk to a neighbor, he's sitting very nicely at your left and waiting for his next command. And the next command that we're going to demonstrate for you is the stay. The stay is a hand and a voice command and because it is a stationary exercise it's a one word command. This exercise can be practiced in your home as well as outdoors. When Barry returns back to him, he will walk all the way around him, returning all the way back around to heel position. And each time that you return back to the dog's shoulders, he expects to get another command. Barry praises him up for a job well done, and they're going to take off healing again. And if you notice, Barry's talking to him, keeping him well under control, but keeping him focused. Nice automatic set. Very well done. Such a cute little guy. He's doing such a good job. Nice automatic sit. Barry leaves him again in a stay. And remember, your stationary exercises should be practiced right in your home. It helps to develop attention span and maturity. This time, instead of returning back to him, Barry's going to call him. This is the recall. The command is, buddy, come. He should come in and sit right in front of you, facing your knees. And then when Barry tells him to heal, he returns back to heel position and back sitting. And he gets pat for praise. And they're going to set up to demonstrate that recall or that come on command. And remember, your coming is very important command. So you always want to make it happy. When your dog comes to you, always praise him. Always make it a happy event. Barry leaves him in a stay and he's going to use his name, he's going to lighten his tone. Buddy, come. Good job. And he comes right in and even though he's very happy about it, he comes in and sits. And then he returns to heel position. Now the next exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you are your down commands. We're going to set up for your down commands. The first down is a down from a heel position. So with Buddy at your left side, just like when you started, Barry's going to use the open flat of his palm, straight down toward the ground, and the one word command to down. And then he leaves him in a stay. And remember the importance of these stationary exercises. They help to develop attention span, maturity, focus, self-control. So you want to practice them, your long sit stay, you're going to start out with 30 seconds, work up to a minute and then three minutes, your long down stay is three to five. Barry returns all the way back around him as he did on the sit stay for an additional distraction. He praises him up, he'll heal him out of that and we'll demonstrate that down from a heel one more time. He's really doing a great job. Remember, open flat of your left palm straight down toward the ground. And the one word command to down. He leaves him in a stay. And when you get a little bit more familiar and comfortable with using your exercises, you can switch them up. So this time Barry will call Buddy out of the down. Buddy, come. There he goes. <laughs> Beautiful set. And this that eliminates him coming to you and jumping on you. 
He doesn't get praised until he comes and sits. And then we're going to set up for our down from a distance. And it's a more difficult command because the dog's not next to you. Barry leaves him in a sit stay. stay. Walks away from him. This is the only time that you'll see us use our right hand to give the command. And Barry will drop him into a down. Now, if he doesn't go, Barry's going to say no, and he's going to repeat the command. There you go. So no matter whether he does it or whether he doesn't do it, you maintain the same demeanor. You tell him no, and you repeat the command. And Barry returns back to him. Now, we've demonstrated for you your heel, your automatic sit, your stay. You're down, you're down from the distance, and you're come. These are the exercises that you're going to practice with him at home. You're going to get lots of private one-on-one -on -one coaching. He's been a pleasure to have, and he's done a great job. Thank you for choosing Nora's Dog Training Company.